He's going back to Yoshi. So hey, I mean, when it, when it comes to it, right, <laughs> pride, pride and joy, stick with it. It's got you this far, you know, and you got that style. And also, you know, like, what if it is that, that matchup experience that he wants? You know what I mean? Like, yeah. you know, like we said, you know, he's near the top of the charts, if not the very, very top of the charts right now. He has these points, and, and right now what he could be doing is he could be looking for this match experience to the point where he's like, I got to be able to beat him eventually, right? Like, I don't think any of my other mains... <laughs> I mean, it's, heart, heart built for it, and I don't think this one is either. I don't know, man. I'm I'm, I'm trying to defend them, but I, I I'm watching this game, and, and right now the hundred to one oh three or zero to one oh three was was quite the path. The the lack of platforms is just gonna make this so easy for Desi to just oh stand my there, gosh. parry the eggs, and then just throw thunder in in objects. And Thunder and, Robotic basically has fire. to just either hit him on shield or go for grabs and either way like it's just a 50 50 and desi can just keep backing up and using that uh using his aerials and his uh projectiles to keep him at bay and really make him force him into those awkward situations and every like unsuccessful grabs. attempt it's 20 30 percent a piece already up to 67 percent yep yoshi just doesn't seem like it's gonna be it at least not tonight it, it, if he's looking for experience juicy. in his matchup he's getting it right now yeah he uh, is. i don't know to what conclusive end that would help him Potentially reset the uh, the bracket here. I love the I love the falling back air and down tilt. That, that feels good. Oh, oh. that was whew, that would have been. We he's going. He's going. Dunder Robotics. Dream. He's turning it on. He said, "Okay, well, if the only oh, there we go, there we go. Whew, that's what I'm talking about. Look, 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 look at him go. Look let's go. Him. Let's go. Nibble, dibble. Do, do that shake. Do that dance." <laughs> I mean, hey, if the only way is going to be to turn on hyper aggression, and at this point, I feel like that's what you do. If you're if you're uh, if you're Doctor Robotic here, you just go hard. You don't care what percent you are. You don't care what hits you. You don't care about safe attacks. You're just going deep, and you're just going to fight because you can't let Desi just get in his mode. You can't let him just sit back and throw and poke at you. You have to really just turn it on and play as aggressive as possible and force him out of his comfort zone. I feel like Doctor Robotic just. I 100% agree. I think he just needs to throw caution to the wind a bit more. One thing that we haven't really seen him do is use spot dodging. Mm. I like to see him just try to like mix God, some of these. Hairs. It hurts. It hits you. You understand that something happened to you, and you're back at zero percent. Mm. Nice combination. Great. Right. He's he's really really good at those conversions. I love seeing those up air conversions. Getting out of the way. His shield was just about to go, so he got out just in time, but. That grab still ends up taking him all the way up to 74% on his last stock. That's just, oh man, so much damage coming out from uh, from Desi here. He really just seems to have a, a grasp on this on this matchup, and especially with, like you said, without platforms, this is just not the stage for him. It, it makes it that much more simple for Desi to just zone out Dr. Robotnik with this matchup. He, he doesn't have those platforms just to you know to regain that jump halfway through the the progress of the stage, right? So instead. He ends up jumping, and then he just ends up falling directly into either a projectile or a grab trap or whatever it may be. I I, I would actually like to see Dr. Robotic use the grab more. Desi's definitely been conditioned to throw up the shield anytime Dr. Robotic jumps in. Uh, you land a grab or two just to try to break him out of that if you do want to go back to committing towards these aerial attacks. Just kind of create a 50-50 of sorts. Yeah, I, I, I like that too. I, I like a lot of like the, the falling uh, falling air of aerials onto the shield straight into a spot dodge. You know, I'd like to see some of that too, especially when it's a little bit less safe because... Uh, <sighs> one because mm. we've been seeing that a lot he's just, he'll just be doing that sometimes he'll do a falling uh aerial straight to down tilt which we've seen work sometimes as well yeah. but that really depends on kind of like what side he's landing on um and then but a lot of the other times he's just going he's just getting grabbed right straight at a shield and shield grab a little slower in this game so you can def there's definitely right. always potential you know especially if you're hitting getting them with that hit lag to uh spot dodge out so you know maybe i'd like we'd like to see a little bit more of that but who knows? You know, overall that Yoshi has just been. We see like little flashes of it kind of working, but then as the, the moment that Desi re, re, uh, regains any kind of composure, it's just shut down. It's Easy a mentally clap. exhausting matchup because mm -hmm. there are so many different things that Dr. Robotnik has to worry about trying to find their way in that it's just taxing on your thought process. And the moment that starts to wear down, it's like, all right, if I mess up at all, I'm eating 30% damage. But if I do everything right, I'm getting maybe 15% damage done. It's just a hard thing to keep having to continue to win. And the air dodges have definitely been slowing down a lot of the combination assaults. We saw like the up air connect two or three times, and, and then there would be the air dodge, but no follow-up afterwards. So then it just gets back to, okay, I need to jump over eight different hurdles to try to get in an attack. And if I mess up at all, I'm eating a boatload of damage. Boom. Oh. 
What? I thought he oh. almost went Bowser Jr. I was like, all right, sign me up. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm ready. I'm let's in. go. I'm Run in. in. I mean, hey, <laughs> let's it, go. it couldn't have gone much worse, right? <laughs> like, I think we started the last game watching him go straight to 100%. So I, I feel... It was 0 to 103 yeah. at least, something like that. There we go. Okay, so so Castle Siege. So pretty interesting, you know, stra kind of a strange option. I mean, I I think that as Yoshi, you know, it kind of makes sense because the, the angles make it a little bit more difficult for Desi to um, abuse all of his projectiles. Mm -hmm. But because of all the platforms, his aerials are much better. So, you know, I'm not I'm not necessarily yeah. fully sold, but I think that Dr. Robotics nice. kind of taking the best nice. of like that. Egg into the double, the the double neutralizer follow up off the rack attack. The, that was that was cheeky. Heads up playing, showing to me that Doctor Brotnick still playing, you know, at full mental capacity. One of the things I like, one of the things that's interesting interesting to me about the stage is like you're effectively fighting in a phone booth. Like it's so small. Like you're not really running away and zoning against anyone, especially with the with the slant in the middle oh. of the stage. But you can also just get thrown off like that. Yeah, he just goes Yikes. straight through him and back airs him. Got him. Only 53% so far, too. So, I mean, this is exactly where Desi wants to be. Like, taking that first stock with such a lead just allows him to play slow, play his game, go for grabs, and stay and stick with zoning from his projectiles. He doesn't need to do anything else. He can really just hang out, run to opposite sides of the map, run around, nair, fair, oh, do whatever he wants. There it and is. Sometimes get absolutely slapped off the side of the stage and make everything I say irrelevant. So. <laughs> It's hard to stay away from your opponent on this stage. Yeah, you said so yourself. Photo worse. booth, the photo booth you're syndrome. Just, you're just in there. <laughs> Smile. Uh, when, when does it transform to the... I'm just kidding. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. all right. I'm like, all right, Spokane Valley. They, yeah. they, their tournament rules are a little wild. <laughs> Down here, stage morphing. It does. Everything starts to turn to clouds. Like, oh, wait. Like, uh-oh. There we go. Little, uh, got the parry there, but it wasn't quite enough. Too many multi-hits. Um, and actually, Dr. Robotic bringing it back a little bit here. He doesn't want to go down without a fight. Definitely getting a couple good conversions here, putting in some good damage overall. Um, that down air straight onto the shield. Ooh, command grab. You know, I like that command grab quite a bit. I, I, it's pretty bad, but it's like, you know, it's, it's cool seeing it like damage and heal at the same time. I, I, like the, I like the concept of his command grab, I guess. I think it's a nice mix-up option. You don't want to necessarily hang your hat on it too much, but... Uh, yeah, we've, yeah we've a seen free, him, I think, miss a and free get 10% trades. Like, I get 10% or so back and do about 10, 20%. That's pretty good. Yeah. A lot of, lot, that's actually, I mean, there's a decent amount of pretty solid kill or uh, command grabs in, in ultimate. Uh, oh! We take those. That's a trade. Out here playing beach volleyball with this in space. Mm. Spite. It's the Spokane Valley Grand finals let's get some washington faces in chat from our subs if you guys are not subscribed when you subscribe you get emotes dedicated to each of our facilities so you can represent your local location so let's get some subs let's get some sub hype and let's get some washington's in chat for our boys here in the grand finals after a bit of dancing around dr robotic went for the grab just a, a hair late that's who was able to get around that some damage in 112 percent oh. racked up on that second stock that's he looking for the edge guard we're diving in oh deep my gosh he he just we just are so, having this conversation so little that yoshi can do off stage like he, <laughs> he's just like if i do any of these options i die no matter what you know what i mean and it's just like here's an egg you know <laughs> and desi's just like I, I got this oh okay that connects oh i'm surprised he went through the platform that was incredible. Thunder's gonna find his way home. Command grab, that gets missed. Hey, let's go the right there. Oh, yoink. There it 97%. is. 97%. That actually healed a lot more than I thought it would. That's what you like. That's what we like to see here. The command grab life. Dr. Robotic okay. is real close to taking this game number two. He wants to take this. He wants his revenge. And I mean, if Dr. Robotic drops this game on, on, on Castle Siege, I'm not sure uh, <laughs> I'm not sure where to go next, right? Like, this seems kind of like his ace in the whole map, where he was like, all right, well, you can't really, you can't zone me very well on this map. It's really small. It's, it's this is my, this is really my go-to space itself. So outside of this, I mean, what's what's the next closest map to something along these lines? Like, you just have to go for a battlefield concept and, and pray? I feel like Yoshi's Ooh. Island. Ooh, Yoshi's yeah. Island. Okay. Just because it has, okay. like, like, it's pretty much battlefield, but the edges are slanted, so it's harder to get the, uh, the projectile oh, fire to set up. A, oh, oh, that's it. There we go. Doctor Robotic, very Out close. Here back flipping. Un un. Let's go. One one. Got him. Close. Grand finals. Doctor Robotic is in loser side, however. So if he does need to win two best of fives, if he wants to take this home, um, but you know, 
I'm not gonna say Desi's gonna make it easy for him. He only needs two games to take this home. Did he? And who won last week? Uh, Desi. Desi won last week. Okay, so and this it, came, it came down to it. Game ten, right? Yeah. We, we said. Okay, so this would be his back-to-back -back victories here. You know, great for the scoreboards, great mm -hmm. for the sheets, as we like to see. Um, there's those emotes on your screens, by the way, ladies and gents. Represent each one of your locations. We got some Washingtons in chat. I like what I see. Hey. Some C's in chat. Some okay. O's in chat. Okay. It's getting okay. too crazy. Okay. Texas in chat. Cali in chat. NorCal in chat. Look at that. Look how hype this is. <laughs> <laughs> we got all our locations represented down there. Um, we have seven locations, but two of them are NorCal, so they get a share one bear. Share one bear. Share the bear. Nice. They're we really going? thinking about what this next stage is going to be. I told you, you know, it it's, means it's, a lot. It's wild. Smashville. Looking hmm. to be the play? So, I mean, Desi's picking, right? So, yeah. I mean, what do you ban? You, I mean, Final Destination, we already won on, so we don't have to deal with that. So, what do you ban then? I would have ban, right, town I been Yoshi's and Castle Siege, DBH. Oh, I mean, but. Uh, oh, way, right? the other way around? Yeah, yeah. Probably Final Destination. But they, they won on that game one. So, we can't play that again, right? Um. I think I mean yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm like pretty stuck. Like, what do you what do you care about? Town yeah. City? I guess that's it. Cause you just don't care about moving platforms, right? <laughs> like, yeah. I don't know. Like, but I love Smashville. I think Smashville's a, a pretty neutral pick. Um, at this point, you know, like you said, Castle Siege and uh, Yoshi's Island are really kind of the go-to's for uh, for Yoshi. And I'm sure we might see one of those if Dr. Robotic feels like dropping another game. <laughs> <laughs> pretty sure he'd prefer not to, but does he? Uh, he may not have a choice in the matter, buddy. Well, uh, so far, pretty even, you know, just uh, kind of getting uh, getting back into the mode here as he's using those aerials and just kind of getting ready to throw some electricity and flames, you know, the usual. Yeah. Yeah, but now that, uh, you know, you can already see Dr. Robotic utilizing that platform a whole bunch, using it to get around the map and use it as that centerpiece to just close in without having to deal nice. with those projectiles. Love the conversions as always. Great trades. Space from there, gets around the attempted forward tilt. Yeah. Ooh, the dash attack got a little bit punished there. Looks like Dr. Bot got a little jumpy. Robotnik again fading in with those back airs. We've seen him quite a bit Ooh. tonight. Oh, he was going Get for it. Get punished with the grab afterwards, turns around. Oh! oh lights him up! 140% Dr. Robotnik still alive. Gets back towards and the, the stage, back air. but a See, back uh, air. Backhand, wow. goodbye. What what a turnaround because like it seems like the tides were you know fairly even maybe a little bit than Doctor Robotics favor as far as just the general tide of the match goes and then all of a sudden I know where Desi's just like oh hey what's up uh, right. fire lightning you're done <laughs> spark him up and what nice attack tech. a B Heisman pose Desi's and already back, back in the too. wow really really good defense the command grab as oh well my God, that heals for so much. <laughs> Definitely what you want to see here. And I mean, I mean it, when you have a stock lead like this and you're able to land you know, a command grab or two like that and just get that 10, 20, 30% back, it's like, that's a huge difference. You know, that can be what you need to, to take another stock without being, without dropping your first one even. So you it's so demoralizing. So greedy, it's like, and it, as it's hard so as it is, yeah. it's as hard as it is to rack up damage against Desi Robin. It's like, all right, I got to do another 30%. Ooh, down B, testing the limits of that shield. This is like, that even great. Dr. Robotic's definitely close to losing the second stock. Fairly even on... Oh, and he was trying to go in for the same combo again, but Dr. Robotic's... Ooh! <laughs> down Yoshi! B. Hey! Hey, hey, what's up? <laughs> hey, what's, are you looking for my down B? Here you go. It's crazy, you know, you're right. Like, he's definitely been utilizing that a decent amount tonight. Uh, just as, some, as a good kill confirm, oh. you know, mix-up. Because mm -hmm. even if you block the first hit on the way up, which most people don't. It's the way on the way down too, so it's very, uh, you know, gets in your head. Especially off of a like a down air that gets the full amount of shield damage, that might actually be enough to break. We'll see though. Ten point three percent on Doctor Robotnik's last stock. That start eating some damage. Comes back in, throws the forward air, picks up the item, throws it back. Part Peach throws it down again. Item management. Ooh. Have an egg. Ooh, we actually managed uh -oh. to get out of there. Well, that was a little scary. Yeah. I was, I was afraid that Desi was going to run off the stage and just down B. <laughs> or up B, I mean. <laughs> Send the waves down, you know? Spike on him. Ooh, there we go. Another shield grab. Double jump the cheese. Just a little bit of lightning to poke. I like the lightning poke. Couple options there. I love the narrow shield. Always good, but good. 
I like this run-up shield Ooh. option that uh, Dr. Robotnik's starting to, to roll into in neutral. Got the got the neutral air attack afterwards, but uh, that thunder is going to have enough lockdown to get the throw. <sighs> Looking for the spike. That's what I want. That's what I want. You. Hey, t take your – it's cheating. You know, they're listening. Yeah, they, got, yeah, yeah. They, got caster, they got caster audio for sure. You know, he's, he's making all my wildest <laughs> dreams come true here. Oh! Dr. Bonnet goes good. high where Desi goes low. Now he needs to get back on the stage. Dash attack looking Scary. for the spike. Just misses that aerial damage. Really, yeah, a little bit from damage Desi's Robin. 95%. Every percentage that Desi's able to get during this second stock is just going to make closing this game out that much easier. Dr. Robotnik, he has to get this stock before he eats any more shots like that, or it's going to be real hard for him to win game number three. Go for that back air. Oh, he was able to close oh. that. Great conversion with that up air there. All right. Beautiful. This is doable. Yeah, Great we're back in it. Getting a little scary there. You can't hang out there forever. Over there, just testing that egg. Have an egg in response. The remix. You didn't think I was going to throw it to? I will. 13%. I got tons. Of, I got more eggs than you got swords. So here you go. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Bike not letting it go yet. Egg. This is game number three. You run out three. of thunder. I keep throwing these eggs. So. Go. Right now, Dr. Robotnik They're scared. They're, Dr. Mike does not want to lose this stock. He ne he needs this game. He wants to take this game. He knows he still needs to win an entire another best of five after mm -hmm. this and does not want to spend. You do not want to go to game in five game. in a situation where yeah. you're like, even if I win, I got another best of five. Yeah, even if I win, I don't actually win. Like, dang. Uh -oh. And that's it. Uh -oh. That's it. And the roof is raised. So that's going to be Desi going up two to one against Dr. Robotic in the grand finals. And since you know Dr. Robotic's in the loser side, if he loses this next game, this is this is this is it. That's it. That's it's second place for the for the day, you know, for the week. He would still hang on to the number one spot in the overall mm -hmm. standings of Spokane Valley, but that would be a back-to-back -back win, which should bring Desi up to 20 points and ever closer towards closing that gap. Dr. Robotnik, I, I know going into this season felt like, all right, the season, it's mine. Like, I'm winning every game. I'm, I'm winning every week easily. And now the, these two players, Tyson and Desi, are really starting to shake things up. Spokane Valley's getting, getting spicy. Yeah, and I mean, there's, what, two weeks after this one, right? So and then with, with that, especially if Desi manages to sweep through, that's a lot of points. It's possible. There's a lot of points it's going possible. on right there, right? So. You never know what's going to happen with these things. And, and, you know, even if he doesn't end up closing out this season, just all of that practice and learning, you know, he, yeah. he might be the one to take home that $500 prize while, uh, you know, if Dr. Robotics wins the season and heads out to Oakland, he's not there for the 500 right, bucks. So right, right. <laughs> the way I see it is, you know, the first and the second place winners are, are both real winners here. You're all winners. <laughs> We're all winners at heart. But uh, in all reality, Desi is about to destroy we'll in game see. four. We'll we see. will see. You're right. You know, every once in a while, it's like that. Game number two, Dunderbike really turned it on thanks to, mm. to Castle Siege. But it looks like we're just doing uh, doing Battlefield here. But not a normal Battlefield. We're doing a little wild. Super play. Mario Brothers Super 2. Super Mario. All right. Let's see here. It's Potentially classic. last game of Spokane Valley for the evening. There's the grab. Converts him into the egg. I, I still go back to the well of wanting to see more grabs out of Dr. Robotnik. Especially in neutral. The way he's jumping in, he jumps in a lot to, to throw a forward air to test the shield or, or a down air like we just saw. But if he just jumps in and lands with, an, with the grab, gets a pummel or two, throws out the egg, it just it just changes up the conditioning because Desi just seems to be so poised to throw this shield up and deal with these aerial attacks. Yeah, definitely. I mean, and also at the same time, like, <laughs> speaking of grabs, right, we saw two command grabs already in this game so far, but it hasn't been... Uh... Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Hasn't been treating uh, you know Desi too well Ooh. though, because he's, uh, he's had a little struggle this time. Fastball. But now he's just zoning. And this is he's, at, he's like got back in his mode. He's like, all right, you stand over there. I'm gonna throw stuff at you. Try to dodge it. You won't. Ooh. Ooh. It goes for a little bit of a spike jump. there. Yeah. That egg out there, that might just save the stock. Yeah, I was like, you might have got hit by one of those. I'm not sure. You know, I, I haven't seen too much as far as like the angles of what what direction it'll push you. Mm -hmm. um, so I would it would have been interesting to see Doctor Bike actually get hit by the down B there and see or the up B there and see if it actually would have you know hard spiked him down or just kind of popped him up a little bit with some damage. What we're seeing here also is that Desi is just able to throw these options out. Able to spam in neutral, go for the fire also, oh. jumps up, gets the aerial attack to take out the first stock of the game. And there aren't really too many opportunities for a punish from Dr. Robotnik. 
So it's like even if Desi misses something, it's just like, all right, well, I can just shield. I can throw it again before Dr. Robotic even gets close. And look at these command grabs. Ooh. Already down to 71%. Oh, my word. Ooh, spot dodge there. I'm good. Getting that forward there. That short hop forward there is just so good. Just, just it covers such a large range and really just pushes them off. Oh, we also just heard Ooh. Mr. Ping won 3 1 against Squire Lynx, continuing to rule the roost. Asus didn't make it there. Asus, uh, uh, 